Thanks for joining us on the John Mandola Show. We're driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers. Let's talk Delaware Valley High School football. Connor Lutz joining us right now. And uh, Connor, congratulations. You made some decisions recently on where you're going to spend the next several years. Uh, tell us about your decision as far as uh, your upcoming career in football and academically. Uh, well, I'm very excited to get my decision out. Uh, Want to get a lot for the playoff time. And uh, really comfortable with my decision to go to Delaware. Um, it really offered me the most out of all the other schools. Uh, it made it seem like the best fit to me. Got the right vibe and everything like that. So I feel comfortable with it. Well, it's nice when you have a coach that uh, played at a big-time place like Coach Olsimer, and he played at Penn State. So uh, I'm sure he, he talked about that conversation you guys had. I'm sure you had conversations with your family as well. But uh, tell us about uh, that right fit. What was it about Delaware, University of Delaware, you said, okay, this is the place I want to be? Well, um, I went down there a couple times. Um, I talked to their coaching staff pretty much every week. They were honest with me throughout the entire process. Um, you know, it was kind of just, just nothing really stood out on paper, but I uh, just got the right feeling, just uh, really where I wanted to be the next couple of years. Well, you got a good size to you, that's for sure, about 6'5", 260 pounds to start the season. Uh, how about as far as projection-wise? Uh, do you feel that you're more of an offensive player or a defensive player, or you'll find out where they think you should fit? Well, uh, they told me the whole time that they see me as an offensive tackle. Um, I kind of agree with them there. You know, I, got, I think I can definitely project to be an offensive tackle, gain a little bit of weight and everything like that, and um, it's going to be a good fit for me. Uh, pretty much play tight end now, more of a blocking tight end. And, uh, you know, I'm about 260 right now, so in a little bit of weight, I can definitely play tackle to the next level. Connor Lutz from Delaware Valley here on the John Mandola Show, driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers. Uh, what a season it was for, for you guys. Obviously, um, your season is over and falling to Parkland, but uh, talk about the resiliency of uh, your group this year. You guys go down to Florida, you start with a loss, you reel off uh, those 10 games in a row, and then you fall to Parkland. But uh, uh, Coach mentioned that the, not the biggest guys on the line overall. I mean, you're one of the biggest guys, no doubt, but – Talk about the the group of guys that worked hard this year for you guys to have a super season. Well, I mean, our line really stepped up this year. Uh, last year, a lot of the guys returned, so I think that helped a lot. But, I mean, we definitely got the biggest guys. They're all about 5'8 and 190. And, uh, I mean, they definitely overachieved. And, uh, you know, they they really grinded through every game. They outworked their opponents. So, uh, you know, they're a big part to our success, success this year. How about uh, one of your teammates, Lex Rosario, uh, a guy that uh, heck of an athlete, that's for sure, on your team? Uh, yeah, I mean, we, we knew he was going to have a big year this year. Uh, he really worked hard this all season. Uh, we knew just t- uh, it was going to happen for him this year. Um, he really uh, exploded for him. Second game of the year against Valley West when he was out close to 400 yards. And, uh, you know, he's just a work- workhorse for us. Uh, we really trust him. You know, we got the ball in his hands when, uh, whenever we need a big play. Connor, how about uh, as far as, you know, what you want to do uh, at the collegiate level? What do you want to study at the next level? Is that something you already have decided? Um, I haven't decided that yet, but, uh, you know, I've, I've been, uh, you know, thinking about either communications or business, maybe education as well, so. Well, it's good to keep your options open, that's for sure. Connor, how about the, some of the attributes you have? You mentioned that you're a little bit of a blocking tight end. You have that stuff down. How about the weight room uh, stuff that you do? Tell us about your work ethic and what you do to prepare for football. Well, I mean, um, I, I really hit the weights this year. Uh, I gained about 30 pounds since last year. I knew, uh, you know, I had to step up this year. This was my senior season. Uh, I was captain of the team and everything like that. So, um, you know, the weight room was a big deal for me this year. Uh, so I try to, you know, outwork everyone, get the team going, be a good leader and everything like that. So, yeah. Tell us about the family support. Uh, tell us about, you know, any athletes in the family or, or getting that support of people coming out to your games. Um, yeah, well, my, uh, my parents really supported me through the whole process of, uh, you know, picking a school and everything like that. Uh, they really, they really helped me. They didn't, you know, like lean, lean towards any school or anything like that, but, uh, they're happy with my decision and everything like that. They uh, fell in love with Delaware, and uh, all my siblings are happy for me as well. 
Well, Connor, you have a bright future ahead of you. We uh, congratulate you on picking the University of Delaware, uh, as you mentioned, a uh, bright future ahead of you. So we wish you the best of luck and congratulations. All right, thank you. Senior offensive uh, tight end, of course, plays a little D-line, probably going to be a tackle in college. He knows it, they know it, and uh, going to have a bright future there as a blue hen. Here on the John Mandola Show, we're driven by McCarthy Tire and Automotive Centers.